blesses everyone. God bless you. God bless you. God bless you. I give God a praise for today. Today happens to be a special day in my life. Today is my birthday. And I'm sitting here reflecting on the good things that the Lord has done for me. The good things that the Lord has done unto my life. The wonderful things. The opportunity He has given to me to be alive. The air that I breathe. Provision. Protection over me. He has done me well. He has done so much for me. He's been so, so good to me. He is an incredible God. He is my way maker, my deliverer, my savior. He's all in all to me. He is my defense, my rock, my shield, my pathfinder. And I'm sitting here reflecting. My God has done so much for me that I cannot tell it all. He has put a new song in my mouth. And I'm celebrating today with gladness. Counting my blessings, naming them one by one. It is a good thing to count your blessings. It is a good thing to name them one by one. It is a good thing to be grateful to God. It is a good thing to show gratitude. It is a good thing to always say, Thank you, Jesus. We must cultivate the habit of thanking Him. We must cultivate the habit of worshiping God for who He is for what he has done in the past and in anticipation of what he will continue to do. He is Jehovah El Shaddai, the God who is more than enough for our situation. Let us never take it for granted. Let us never take for granted even the miracle of sleeping and waking up among many others that he do, he has done for us and that he's doing for us. When we are grateful to God, we will even receive more blessings of the one from whom all blessings flow. Let us cultivate the habit of praising him, of thanking him, of saying thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. For you have been so, so good to me. You have done so much for me. I cannot tell it all. If I have 10,000 tongues, it's not enough to praise you. It's not enough to praise him for everything that he has done. For everything that he is doing. And for all the things that he is yet to do. When we praise Him, when our praises go up, our thanksgiving go up to Him, blessings flow like never before. He has done so much for me. I cannot tell it all. So much. Count your blessings. For those of us who are children of God, we must not take God's grace and blessings for granted because we cannot remain in sin and expect grace to abound. So we must live righteous to be able to receive more from the Lord and be able to count our blessings. And when I mean our blessings, I mean unlimited blessings, overflowing blessings, favor like never before. We need to show our appreciation to Him. Let us show our appreciation by living for Him alone and by glorifying Him in our bodies. 
Let us make it a habit of counting our blessings and testifying to God's goodness at all times. Make our time to make a list of all God's blessings upon your life and give Him thanks from the bottom of your heart for each of them. Psalms 103, 1 to 2 says, Bless the Lord, O my soul, and all that is within me. Bless His holy name. Bless the Lord, O my soul, and forget not all His, bene- all his benefits. In the Bible, David took some time to list the blessings of God upon his life so that he would not overlook any of them. How often do we take our time to really appreciate God for our health, for our well-being, for all that he has done or for all he is doing and for all that he's yet to do? How well do we thank him whenever he heals us, whenever he provides for us, whenever he delivers us, whenever he fights sin and unseen battles for us? Do we even remember to thank God for waking us up in the morning, for the air that we breathe, for counting us among the living, for life? Ingratitude is dangerous, particularly when it's directly shown against the Almighty God. There are many things that we enjoy from God, but we often take them for granted. Let us write from today. Make it a habit to say thank you, Jesus. To say thank you, Lord. To be grateful. To show gratitude to God for all that He is doing and He has done. And when we do that, He will do more for us. Count your blessings and name them one by one. And it will surprise you what the Lord has done. God bless you. Have a blessed day. Shalom.